Good morning friends, I hope you guys are doing well. I'm going to take you on just a simple, realistic, and productive day in my life. So I just started by making the bed and then turning on the fish light and I'm going to head off to go do a workout with Garrett. I highly encourage you guys to try to go get a workout in. Today was upper body day and it was such a good workout and I just feel so much better after I get my workout in for the day. Now it's time for Garrett and I's protein shake that we pretty much make every morning. I love using this Health Code brand because it's not only protein but a bunch of other vitamins for you and then I add extra greens and I'll link everything down below for you guys. Today I actually put makeup on because Garrett and I had a Zoom meeting for a wedding venue that we're looking at. We're about to hop on and talk to a new wedding venue that we're looking at and kind of get a quote and get a tour of the place. We've been really struggling trying to find a wedding venue because they're very expensive extremely expensive kind of fingers crossed this is like a new venue so they have really good prices right now so we shall see we'll let you guys know yes we will here's my outfit and i'm gonna link everything down below for you guys and I'm about to change into something a lot comfier than this because we're just hanging out around the apartment today. And here's the comfy outfit of the day now. So I've decided that I'm gonna start on making some bread for tonight, some homemade bread. I think I'm gonna make baguettes actually. So I think that's gonna be really nice for dinner because we're just gonna have like pasta and sausage. Uh, I love making like homemade bread and homemade like bagels and homemade garlic knots and all of that. So I think that's what I'm gonna do today. And then I'm gonna probably clean up the linen closet after this and just get some more work done. So as the yeast settles right now, um, I wanted to let you guys know that I will be linking the recipe and directions down below for the baguettes. Now what I'm gonna do, now that this dough is ready, I'm just gonna cover it and I'm gonna put it by our window on our coffee table for about 30 minutes for it to rise and then I'll come back to it and we'll do a little bit more to the mixture and then do the second rise, which where it'll rise for about an hour. <laughs> So this is the current status of our linen closet. It's not too bad, but I'd like to just clean it back up and organize it some more. Guys, do you guys think I have enough candle waxes? <laughs> I think I have a small obsession and it's kind of a problem. In this container I got off of Amazon, which I will link down below for you guys, and it fits so perfectly in here. 
So this is the finished look of the linen closet. It's not much of a change, but it's just a lot more organized and everything's put back in place and I got rid of things that we didn't need anymore. And I'm hoping to use my Cricut that I got for Christmas to make new labels for these because right now I just have sticky notes. Some of my friends and I that I went to college with decided that we're going to try to read through the Bible in one year and we're using the Bible app to help us. I can link down below the exact plan that we're going through, but it has been so helpful. And it has like a bunch of videos like beforehand, just kind of describing it more in detail, which is really helpful, especially in the Old Testament. It also keeps us accountable because each day we go through and at the end of every day, we just write like something that really spoke to us. I really encourage you to try to do it as well. And getting a group of friends is really a nice way to grow together and to keep each other accountable as well. And just getting in the habit of reading every day, whether it be in the morning or afternoon. Now we're just having leftovers for lunch from our Taco Tuesday yesterday and watching last night's This Is Us. The show really gets to me. <laughs> so here is the bread situation thus far. And so what I'm supposed to do is take that out and fold it into thirds, it says, um, twice. So I'm gonna do that. And then I'm gonna put it back in this bowl and I'm gonna oil it and then it's going to rise for about another hour or two. I'm about to put this out on our coffee table for it to warm up and rise. And another trick that you can do is you can actually turn your oven on and just set the bowl on top of the oven and get the heat from the oven as well and rise a little bit faster. We shall see if it doubles in size by the time we need it to. So just a little wedding venue update. We did really like the venue that we kind of like toured over Zoom. They're like a new venue out here in Massachusetts. So they're like currently being built and they are offering really good prices for the venue and that's like one of the biggest things for us is we might have found a place it like pushes back like our ideal date like back a little bit we were hoping for like late summer but this would push it back to like early fall but it could be a steal for the price so i wanted to update you guys on that and as the dough is rising i'm actually playing a little animal crossing if you guys don't know already i'm actually like a big nerd <laughs> you guys should definitely let me know if you play animal crossing as well it's absolutely my favorite game i decided to have a little iced coffee situation here i made a peppermint iced coffee the family that i nanny for actually got this mug for myself and there's another one for garen it says me too and i think they're so cute also as i'm waiting i'm starting gilmore girls i'm literally on the first episode and you guys should let me know what you guys think it's really slow to begin with but one of my friends recommended it to me so so now I've separated the dough and it's gonna rest for another 20 minutes and then we can start cooking. And in the meantime, I'm gonna do some laundry and I'm just snacking on some cheese and I actually have kombucha in this wine glass, just, just because. <laughs> I gotta say these baguettes turned out absolutely amazing. It was a perfect touch to our little pasta dish that we had. I just ended my night by editing another video and watching the Portland Trailblazers play. If you guys are liking my videos, be sure to subscribe down below so you get notified of my next video and I will hopefully see you guys in the next one.